Hello, and welcome back to Redneck Snack Review Reviews. It's going to be a pretty quick review. Um, if you watched my video from about a week ago, um, I explained the shaking. I'll explain it again. Um, this video is being taken on a nice scenic porch. And the thing I'm using to uphold my phone is a bench swing. So it's a bench, but it's a swing. So, nothing's holding it up but two big chains on each side. And, uh, well, putting these things on the bench and putting my phone makes the bench swing for a little while. So, it may eventually just stop, but right now it's just swinging a little bit. So, that's why my phone is shaking. Before we get into this review, I hope you give it a like, a comment, and a share. Go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Check out my Instagram, Redneck Snack for Food. Now, this has been out for a couple weeks at least. Um, doesn't really look like it's shaped out really well. It looks like ice on the top and then liquid on the bottom. But whatever, I'll try and mix it. Um, but, uh, so they have a new pink lemonade Minute Maid slushy at McDonald's. And I'm not happy because I like the peach one. Now, how many times had I had, had I had the peach one? Only once. But was it good? Yeah. Now, do I understand why they're doing this? Heck yeah, I do. Um, because nobody does a pink lemonade slushie, as far as I know. Um, 7-Eleven may do a slurpee. Who knows? But, you know... As, even though peach slushies haven't been known very well, people prefer to go get them a peach milkshake from Chick-fil-A or from um, Cookout. Or, you know, they prefer to go and get that orange cream shake at Arby's. So, in balance aside, let's just do something more conventional and do lemonade. And this is the third... Is this the third year they've changed it up? Or is it just the second? Because I don't, I can't remember if the first time they did the slushies, if they only did two of them. But I think they did three. And I can't really put my finger on what it was before it was peach. But I think they did something. Um, and I could be wrong. It could have just been two flavors. But uh, yeah, not going to be a long video. Just going to be me slurping down this slushy i can't remember if they have like any sodium in these like if they're salty at all but um just gonna try it tell y'all what i think i know there's a lot of reviews on the on here already about it so I'm not gonna get a lot of views so i'm not too worried about that but you know we're here and this is what i've got so i hope you enjoy this video No, no sodium taste at all. For the most part, it just tastes like a regular old lemonade. I'm sucking at the top because I want to get those icy, icy, uh, that icy texture. And they gave it to me this way, so. And I stuck it in the freezer for about 10 minutes, so. It didn't really help to make the liquid um, you know, get a little harder, but anyways, it's fine. I mean, it's good. Extremely sugary. Extremely. So if you're not one for sugar, you might not like this, but I think it's good. And it's got that lemonade flavor that you would want. It's simple, though. Good, but simple. Very sugary. So, typically I would give that stuff an 8, but I think it's so good that I'm going to give it a 9. And it's really throwing me back to when I would go on those splurges drinking a lot of lemonade. There were times in the past where it'd just be, okay... I like lemonade now, so I'm going to drink lemonade. And you know what? Um, I went a while without drinking lemonade. And it 
So, so I don't want to spend too long talking about this. Again, this is a nine sugary lemonade taste. Very pretty drink. Definitely a better pink drink than Starbucks mess, you know. Hmm. But anyways, um, get to the point. I I used to drink Sprite and Red Gatorade, Fruit Punch Gatorade. Those were the two drinks I would spend most of my time drinking. I'd switch back and forth, back and forth. And for a while there, Fruit Punch Gatorade really became the only thing I would drink. And so, I was trying to lose weight. I was eating less. And I was doing good. Doing a good job. I told myself, eventually I think I can I can do water. I hated water for a while. I told myself, this is never going to work in the past. But I told myself, it was going to work. So I switched to lemonade. It's like, you know, drinking some cans of lemonade. Not too bad, right? You know? I mean, it weaned me off of Fruit Punch Gatorade. But speaking of Fruit Punch, I have Fruit Punch of this too. Um, I still haven't tried it. Apparently, Minute Maid's Fruit Punch is pretty good. So, let me just try that. I'm not going to do a review because, you know, that's way outdated. But, so, I would wean me off of Fruit Punch Gatorade. And then, it's like, let me try these diet lemonades. They don't have so much sugar in them. They don't have any sugar. And I'm like, hmm. Diet lemonade. This stuff's good. It's like, okay. Diet lemonade sounds, sounds good to me. Um, and then I started drinking water. It's like... It's not so bad. Oh, I got... How do I have brain freeze at this point? Like, I've been sitting here talking and it's just like... Hit me. Man. Man, oh man. Um, but just to get to Chase, because there's a phone call in there from my grandma and my grandma's house. Um, but to get to the point, I was drinking water. And I had these cans of lemonade and... I don't, I don't know who finished them, but it won't me. So I give, I give, and I think it was Minute Maid Lemonade, Pink Lemonade. I give Minute Maid credit. Thank you, Minute Maid. You made me an avid water drinker. An avid water drinker. You persuaded me to be more healthy. And so, these days I typically only drink water, but... You know, I'll make a trip to McDonald's. I'll get milkshakes. I'll do stuff like that on the occasion. Um, but in my diet, which I don't really have a diet, but the only thing I typically drink with my meals is water. Water's refreshing. Um, treat the earth nice. Don't use all these artificial flavors just because it makes you feel good. So anyways... But you can always get you a nice, nice, a nice sweet drink every once in a while. Anyways, um, yeah, I know I just rambled on there, but I gave you a review. I told you what it's like, and you had the option to just leave this video like that. But anyways, that's what I got to tell you. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, I'll have some more content up in the future. All right, I'll see y'all around. Yee!